Hi everyone, it's Dawn, and today I am only gonna do eyes and lips. And the reason I'm making this video is because I have an eyeshadow palette that I would really recommend to any of you who want to play with color, but not on a daily basis, like on the holidays, a pop of color for you know a special occasion. And because you generally prefer a more natural makeup look, you don't wanna invest a lot of money in colorful eyeshadow palettes. That's how I am. If I see eyeshadow palettes that have bright blues and turquoises and emerald greens and all those purples and bright colors, the jewel tones that I love, but I won't use them on a regular basis. I decide just to pass on the palette, especially if it's an expensive palette. So this palette is affordable, clean, cruelty-free, vegan, and it's only $16 and it would make a great gift for yourself or someone else. So I'm gonna share this palette with you. I'm gonna show you color swatches. I'm gonna do a quick demo and then I'm just gonna do my lips with another product from the same company that is so stunning and it's only $5 and I've been using this as like a go-to lip product for years. So let's just jump in and get started. The palette I'm referring to is this palette from Pacifica and it is called the Cosmic Reflect Palette. And like I said, it's cruelty-free, vegan, clean, and the colors are really beautiful and they're very pigmented. They don't come off patchy. They're easy to blend. I've been a fan of Pacifica eyeshadows for a really long time. So this is what the palette looks like, and it does come with a makeup brush. And as you can see, a lot of the colors are very bright, and you might think I would never wear those, but they're very wearable colors. And I have some color swatches here on a piece of paper. So I'm just going to show you how they look. This is the first row in the same order. So you've got some really nice wearable colors. The color that would be the most like pop of color of all of these would be the purple or violet color, but even that is more wearable. It looks brighter in the palette than it would be on. So this is the first row. Now I'm going to show you the second row. And the same thing, you've got just some beautiful pops of color, but they're all really wearable. The last color, the furthest on my left right here is a shade shifter. It's sort of like that green that kind of shifts to burgundy, but it's just a beautiful, beautiful palette. And I'm going to apply these eyeshadows, not all of them, but some of them, and show you a look that I really like to go to. This is a go-to look. And um, I'm just gonna share with you my eyeliner, mascara, and lip. I'm gonna do one eye just for the sake of time. I'm putting looking glass all over my mobile lid and up into my crease. And now I'm going in with lift off and I'm applying that to my crease with a Morphe or actually an e.l.f. crease brush. And this is just a really pretty orange shade. And now I'm taking magic wand and I'm blocking in my outer corner. And once I get that kind of packed on there, I'm gonna just take whatever is left on the brush and run it along over the lift off, the orange shade, and just softening that up. And now I'm taking magic wand and I'm lining my upper and lower lash line. And now I'm taking my Tarte Ultra Creamy Concealer and cleaning up the edges. I just make a little line there and then use a concealer brush to blend it out and it just makes a very nice, smooth, clean line. Just blending that in. Now I'm going in with Dusty and it's a gold shade and I'm using that to line my upper lash line and my lower lash line. I think that is a really nice touch any time of year, but particularly around the holidays. I really like the gold with the colors I've chosen and I like it in my inner corner too. Now I'm just taking the Bare Minerals eyeliner. I will link it below and lining my upper and lower lash line 
curl in the old lashes. And now I'm using Pacifica's newer mascara and mascara primer. I believe it's called Fluffy Lash, but I'll link that below. And it's collagen infused. It has great ingredients to help nourish your lashes and help you just maintain nice, long, thick eyelashes. And I really like this mascara. I've had really great luck with pretty much all the Pacifica mascaras, except the waterproof one, which I can't think of the name, but I didn't like that one. But I like this one a lot. Okay, I have a lip product that I know I've shared with you in the past when I first started my YouTube channel, if you've been with me that long. And this is from Pacifica, and I've been wearing these ever since they came out. It feels like it was like about eight years ago, maybe 10. I lose track of time, but they're only $5 and they are incredibly hydrating and pigmented. And this one is in the shade Blood Orange and it's the Lip Quench. <laughs> my husband and son are cutting down a tree outside my window. <laughs> they just started, I better hurry. And this is what it looks like. I have a fresh new tube. Okay, I'm gonna bring you in very close. And I hope you enjoyed this Get Ready With Me. I think that this is a beautiful palette to have around the holidays, or like I said, a great gift. I did align my lash line with this gold color right here that I showed you when I did it, but there's also a really beautiful silver down here. And that's so pretty too, for the holidays to line your lash line. That's really pretty with the cranberry color. There are just so many beautiful looks that you can achieve with this palette. And if it's not for you, maybe for someone else for a gift. Like I said, it just comes packaged beautifully. And I hope you enjoyed this Get Ready With Me. If you did, please don't forget to hit like on your way out. Um, if you're not subscribed to my channel, I hope you'll do that. And if you have any video suggestions, let me know down in the questions and comment section. And if you have any questions, ask down there too. Even just say hello. I love interacting with you. And I hope you have a blessed and beautiful day. I'll see you next time.